I am very, very pleased that the government of Antigua and Barbuda has embarked on this initiative. Um, it is going to make us competitive both regionally and globally. See that right there? I was so pleased when I saw the teachers using the laptop and the children were so enthusiastic. You know, they were so focused on the, the, the screen of the laptop to see. You know, because you get the impression that they were visual learners. You know, so this captured the attention. My students learn through seeing pictures, colors. It makes it so interesting and sometimes I cannot find the pictures that I would want to bring to them. And since that I've gotten my new laptop, I find it so easy. It makes teaching exciting. I have used it to show videos in science. You know, I'm doing life cycles, the breath of... I can't show them certain things, so it would be nice to have an animation and so forth. Also, when my students like this taught me, I can go and look up something quickly and come back and give them the answer because you know they think that teachers know everything. And I was fairly okay with managing the computer but having to do it on a daily basis, create PowerPoint, having to look for videos on the internet showed me that the internet is really useful because instead of just going in person going to YouTube listening to music, you can actually find a wide variety of videos that can come in handy in the day's lessons. It gives us a, a, the opportunity to, as it is, carry the world into the classroom. Um, we have become accustomed to certain methods of teaching, but through the laptop, laptop initiative and the use of the internet, we can see other ways of teaching, we can see other tools that can be used in teaching. We'll now be able to do research to enable us to deal or should I say cater to the different needs of our students, not only preparing them for education for the now but for lifelong learning. I still teach as a principal and I've used my laptop to teach history right? and um, that the children are more interested in learning if they have the computer. For instance, one time I um, found a video on subject and predicates and we were doing it and it was a song and they enjoyed it up to now they still sing the song all the time because they enjoyed the song so YouTube has been a part of it we were talking about the body and um, we were doing the heart and the organs on the inside so I'm saying Lord how would I get my students to understand how the heart works? And I was able to go on the computer, download with the YouTube, and actually show them the heart pumping, and they're hearing the book. It was just so exciting. So I really think that it's one of the best things that could have happened to us. In the last several years, we have had only two projectors in this part of the school. And uh, generally, they uh, in the office. They might be used a few times per month. Presently they are used every day. To the extent that I do not have enough projectors to go around for the teachers to use. I see a lot more teachers asking to use the, the, the projector so it means that the technology is being used in the classroom. I see the teachers using the technology that you see the laptop open up and then all the students you know over the laptop looking at, at a video or something like that. Instead of just using the chalkboard I'm using a projector to animate the, the lesson. So instead of writing a number on the board, erasing it and students will see numbers actually moving around and a lot of our students have a poor attention span 
So the animation keeps them interested. We've actually made plans where we intend to have some professional development sessions where we will teach teachers how to use PowerPoint presentation, how to use um, digital storytelling, um, how to use like simple things like Movie Maker, which is right there in the system. And they can actually use them in the classroom to make the teaching learning experience more exciting. Now, the laptop initiative will have an impact in that it will guarantee that every single teacher is now provided with that basic tool to be able to deliver the curriculum which they are, at, they are expected to deliver. They will also be getting full access to the internet and in that way they themselves having done the work, having experienced the use of the tool and the connection with the World Wide Web will now be in a better position to pass that on to the children who are in their care. So I, I have 43, full, um, 43 staff members and of that 43, 15 are involved in online education programs. And so this, this laptop initiative has made it easier for a number of them who didn't have computers and had to be relying on coming to work or, or on borrowing or uh, just a lot of juggling. I think it's one of the best initiatives the government have, have ever undertaken. I have to thank you to the government and to the company line because I think it's one of the biggest things that they've ever done for teachers. If the children are to be in line with technology, the teachers must also be in line as well. We have to know what it's about in order to impart and to guide our students.